Uh, in the face of flaring geopolitical tensions, the global nuclear arsenal is set to rise in the coming years. For the first time since Cold War, the risk of such weapons being used is the greatest in decades. The data has been published in the annual report of the Stockholm International Peace Research Institute. It is a leading conflict and armaments think tank. Now, according to estimates by CIPRI, the nine nuclear powers, Britain, China, France, India, Israel, North Korea, Pakistan, the United States and Russia, had 12,705 nuclear warheads in early 2022. An estimated 3,732 warheads were deployed with missiles and aircrafts. And around 2,000 were kept in a state of high readiness. Nearly all belonging to Russia or the United States, Russia has the world's biggest nuclear arsenal with a total of 5,977 warheads. The number is some 550 more than the United States. The two countries possess more than 90% of the world's warheads. CIPRI says China was in the middle of an expansion with an estimated more than 300 new missile silos. The world military expenditure has also passed $2 trillion, reaching an all-time high figure. A senior researcher at the organization expects the expenditure in Europe to increase again in 2022. So in 2021, military spending rose for the seventh consecutive time uh, to reach $2.1 trillion. That is the first time, that is the highest figure that we ever had. That's an all-time high. And that's the first time, of course, that we surpassed the $2 trillion mark. Military spending, it's not only arms spending. People tend to equate those two things. Of course, military spending covers arms spending and arms procurement, but it's more, much more than that. We have personnel costs. We have research and development, sometimes we have peacekeeping operations and the costs that, it, that are involved. So it's a, it's a much wider uh, uh, concept and uh, the figure will encompass many other aspects other than just uh, arms procurement. Tensions among the world's nine nuclear armed states have been heightened by Russia's invasion of Ukraine and Western support for Kyiv. Director of CIPRI's Weapons of Mass Destruction program says all of the nuclear armed states are increasing or upgrading their arsenals. CIPRI also warned that unless immediate action was taken by the nuclear powers, global inventories of warheads could soon begin rising for the first time in decades. The think tank has called it a very worrying trend. Russia in 2021 increased its military spending for the third consecutive time. That was a 2.9% increase to $64.9 billion. That is the fifth largest military spending uh, in the world. And that accounts for 4.1% of their GDP, which is much higher than the world um, average. And one interesting thing that happened uh, with Russia's military spending in 2021 was that it was revised considerably higher uh, upwards uh, throughout the year. So the difference that we have between the December 2020 figure for the year 2021 and the final actual expenditure figure was 14% higher. So throughout the year, it really revised its, its, um, its uh, spending upwards. And most likely this revision, of course, was because of operational costs. And that happened as Russia amassed troops alongside the Ukrainian border, preceding, of course, the invasion of Ukraine uh, uh, in February 2022. Remember, three days after Moscow's invasion of Ukraine, Vladimir Putin had put Russia's nuclear deterrent on high alert. Putin has made reference to the use of nuclear weapons on several occasions. He has also warned of consequences for countries that stood with, in Russia's way.